Hi, my name is Deborah, and I'm here with webs.com and today I'm going to go over the different email addresses that are configurable within site settings. Now here we are within our site settings and there are three different places where you can see an email address input. The first is here under your webs ID, the second is under your contact email, and the third is where you can send your forms to. Well now I'm going to explain what each of these three sections really mean. Your Web's ID is sort of a master account. What this means is that you can link any of the sites that you've created to one email address. You can use your Web's ID to log in to user sites or to log in to webs.com. Once you've logged into webs.com, you're presented with a dashboard. Under this dashboard are all of the sites that are connected with your one Web's ID with that one email address. The second section you have is a contact email. This contact email is what we here at webs.com use to contact you. Whether it be site promotions, notifications that there's a new guestbook signature, and so on and so forth. The last option here is for where you want to send the forms. Say you've created a web form on your site. Well, any responses received on this web form will be sent to this email address here. Most users find it easiest to have one email address for all of these sections. However, in the case of, say, for a business who wants to have a different contact email from where they send the forms, this just makes it easier to configure different settings. If at any point in time you need to change the email address, you simply click right here on Change, and you can type in the new contact email that you would like to use. It works the same way for your Web's ID. If you want to use a different Web's ID, you can click up here to use another Web's ID. And from here, you can attach your site to an alternative Web's ID. One important thing to keep in mind is that the new Web's ID that you're attaching must already be a member of your site. If you have not yet used this email to sign up for the site, it's easy. You can just go to the Members area and register and type in the email address that you would like to become the new Web's ID. And once you're a member of that site, come back to this page over here and attach that Web's ID. And that is just a quick portion of how to configure some of your site settings. Brought to you by webs.com.